Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use a USB storage device with the Xbox 360. And this can come in handy for those whose hard drives are running low on space, and also for those who just need more space to store all of their stuff. So essentially all you're going to need is either a USB flash drive or an external hard drive, as long as it's a gigabyte or bigger, and you're also going to need the April 2010 Xbox Live update. And then once you have all that, we can go ahead and get started. So assuming that you've already downloaded the April 2010 firmware update, the only thing you're going to have left to do is to plug in your USB flash drive or external hard drive to your Xbox. And it should be worth mentioning again that these devices must be over a gigabyte in order for it to work. So now on your Xbox, go to the My Xbox tab and then scroll all the way down to System Settings. And then go down to the Memory tab, and then at the bottom you should see something that says USB Storage Device. So then on the next page you should see something that says Configure Now. So then just hit A, and this page is just saying that any programs, applications, uh, files you have on your device, it's all going to be erased during the configuration process. And the configuration process for me took anywhere from 45 seconds to about 3 or 4 minutes. Uh, for my 4 gig flash drive it took about 45 seconds, and then for my 500 gig hard drive it took about 2 or 3 minutes. So then once it's done, you're going to see something that says either your device is ready and it meets all Xbox 360 performance recommendations, or if you're like me, my 500 gig hard drive said that it was ready, but it didn't meet the performance recommendations. But when I played Left 4 Dead 2, I never really saw any performance issues at all, so I don't really think it's that big of an issue. So what I'm going to do real quick is just demonstrate me installing Left 4 Dead 2 on my USB hard drive that we just set up. So to do this, all I'm going to do is go to the My Xbox tab, and then go to the game library, and now I'll just select the game that you want to install. So in my case, it's Left 4 Dead 2, and then just hit Install Game, and then you're going to be brought up with a window that says, where do you want to install it? So basically, the memory unit that's underneath the hard drive is the USB hard drive that we just installed. So we're just going to go ahead and let it download. And then once it's done, just go ahead and hit play game. And everything that you're seeing right now is running off of my USB hard drive, and it's not running off of the Xbox's hard drive. And when it comes to frame rates, I didn't really see that big of an issue between it. Um, the only thing that I really noticed was the load times were a little bit slower. Um, not much, nothing really drastic, but it was noticeable. So on pages like this, where it was loading, it did take a little bit longer, but it wasn't really that big of a difference. So yeah, that's pretty much how you get to install um, items on a USB hard drive on the Xbox 360. Um, you can do it with pretty much anything. You can use it with uh, music, videos, demos, um, game content, pretty much anything. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.